Hello, welcome to another video. My name is Now. This video I'm gonna show you how to use VMware to macro on Roblox or do anything else. So please like, subscribe. I may sound different because I am sick and I have a new microphone. And um, yeah, let's get right into it. So first thing you want to do is download the VMware. So where you want to download it is here. Just scroll down a bit. You, you see download now, click that. Um, just save it. Wait for it to download. It's a bit big. So while it's downloading, you're going to the second link in the description. There you see VMware files. You open it. Here you see Windows 8 English. And then right click and also click download. Wait for it to download, for both of them to download and um, then I'll get back at you. Okay. Okay, now that they are finally downloaded, just open the VMware workstation. Click yes. Now uh, wait for it to install. Okay. So I need to restart my PC. Um so I'll do that real quick. Okay, so now it is installing, you just you need to click it again. Um, click next. Accept terms and just click next. Yeah, click next. You don't need this, I just don't like it. So click next. And if you want, you could uh, do, do this. I don't want shortcuts, but I guess it's handy. Install. Wait for it to fully install. Okay. Click finish. Uh, it should be an icon, or you search it up, like so. Just open it. Uh, you need a license key for this, so in a, there's a license key in the description. I got it from the server Natural Macro. I'll also link that in the description if you want to. Click continue and yes. Oh, my license key is invalid. Apparently that one doesn't work, so I just picked one up from the internet. I will do that in the description for you. Um, create a new virtual machine. Click custom. Next. Um, next. So now you're gonna select the Windows 8 file that you downloaded. Click next. The Windows product key. I'm gonna give that to you in a second. It's also in the description. Here's the product key for Windows 8.1 Pro you want. Just call your virtual machine anything you want, so I'll call it my main. You don't need a password at all. Virtual machine name, I guess you just call it main. Um, click just next. Number of processes, click two. Or this one is one, this one two. Course per processor is two. Click on two. Um, memory for virtual machine, do 2500. If you're gonna use my settings. Next, next. Next, create a new virtual disk. Yes, make it like 20 gigabytes. Maybe sometime you're macroing and um, Roblox needs to do an update, you don't have any space, that will just totally mess it up and um, it'll be a, you'll have a bad time. Just click next again. Power on this virtual machine after creation. Let's customize hardware. Check if everything is alright. So go to um, display. And do 512 megabytes. Click close. Finish. So now we'll be creating the virtual machine. This will take a bit. But it's all worth it. It doesn't power on automatically. You just power it on yourself. Now let it do its thing. And um, yeah just wait. Okay, so now that it's finally done, we're gonna de-bloat it. So that basically means that we're gonna delete useless stuff. Like, who, who needs alarms, you know? So just right-click it and click uninstall. 
unlike everything that you don't need. You may want to download um, Google first, of course, yes. It's for really important for macroing. Wait, that's not the right one. This one you need Chrome download and just uh, run. Click yes. Okay, now that's done. Uh, first thing you want to do is search, just click the Windows key on your keyboard and search, um, what's it called again? Default, default programs. Set your default programs and set, set, select Google Chrome and set this program as default. So now what you're gonna do is go to the third link in the description and you're gonna debloat it fully. So basically what it does is removes a lot of things you don't know about that are also useless. So doing this you might want to make a Google Drive and make it downloadable in there. So just download it on your main PC, click download zip, save it, go to your Google Drive and um, just you know, drag it into your Google Drive. Wait for it to upload, should be pretty quick. Just right click, um, share, make it so only people with the link can use it. So click done and then uh, copy the link. Okay, so now you open Google Chrome, paste in the link from your Google Drive and click the download button on the right top hand corner. Okay, so now you gotta drag it onto your desktop. Right click and click extract all. Double click and right click Windows 10 Debloated GUI and run with PowerShell. Click open. Wait for it to run. You don't need to do this, but it is very handy. So click remove all bloatware. Disable Cortana. Disable Edge PDF. And uninstall OneDrive if you have one. Well, just click it. Okay, disable telemetry tasks. Unpin tiles from start menu. And remove bloatware rec, rec keys. Okay, so that's all. You can delete if you want. I'll delete it. So now you're gonna go macroing, I guess. So log into your Roblox account. And now you're going to my video. To the video I made. Go to this how to macro. And just click here and just follow this video. So I'm just gonna quickly do it. Click add a hotkey, download it, open and install. Express installation, exit. Okay, log into your Discord account. Go to the server. Go to Metro Macro. Download the latest version. Just keep it. Put it on your desktop, extract it, double click it and that, that's that. Get the settings you want. In the video I showed you from me, my last video, are one of the best settings you could use. So try using those if you don't. Just try something else. If you want you connect, you can connect a, uh, what's, it, what's it called again, a webhook. I do it because it's very handy. Okay, so now I'm gonna log into my Roblox account. Let me know if I should change my username because it is kind of... Yeah, you know, you, you could understand why. And now download Roblox. Download and install. Double click, run. Okay, it's done, just reload. Refresh. Click always, let Roblox open. So your macro won't mess up. One last thing I'm gonna show you guys is a, a file for Roblox. So your Roblox runs at 30 FPS alt at all times. So 
Now go to the fourth link in the description and here you will see uh, Roblox RFU. Basically Roblox FPS unlocker but better. Go to releases and click 86. Download it, open it and double click and run. You may have to download a newer version if Roblox updates and so right click and do Roblox at 30 FPS so it runs at 30 FPS at all times. So now your Roblox should run at 30 FPS and it will have much less of a tank on your virtual machine. Claim your hive and start making honey or bug running, whatever you want. And if you click or shift F5, you can see here, Roblox, your FPS is at 30. So that's why you should use it. And that's all for today's video. Thank you for watching, sorry for my voice as I explained and um, like, subscribe and see you in my next video. See ya.